this was a little uh, a little nugget I learned at the owners' meetings. I think Kyle said it. These, these Cabo trips get me because you've created a click on the team. You know, the rich in crowd on the team, and when it happened, people were like, "Oh, you know, it's an organic thing. They just all happen to go to the same place to vacation. What's wrong with that? There's nothing wrong with people liking to go to Cabo at the same time. It's not a nefarious plan to split the team. Well, that's was a reasonable thing to think until Kyle Shanahan said that Jed York organizes the Cabo trip. The owner of the team organizes the Cabo trip. So I don't know. I mean, I don't know who sends out the little invitations, but if I were Brandon Ayuk and I didn't get one, I'd be thinking, damn, Jed York didn't invite me to Cabo. Does that mean I'm not getting extended? I mean, honestly, the owner, I thought it was Kyle. The owner is, is, is creating the Cabo click. That's a problem to me. What do you think? Um, yes, yeah, like that's kind of groundbreaking a little bit. I always thought because Kyle, I mean, Kyle's been saying like, "Oh, I love Cobb. I'm going there for years," and I thought the players just followed him, and then Kyle was one that invited him. Like, uh, right? I, I can already right. imagine like you're going past the hall. It's like on a random day, and it's like, Kyle, what's up, with Cabo? It was like, you down? Come through. It's all good. Yeah, exactly. Go like, oh, yeah. Something like that. But yeah. York, maybe that's how it started, and then Jed's like, "Oh my God, I'm trying to do something." I want to come. Him, can I come? <laughs> he invited himself. <laughs> My dream, I'm ready, right, cool. so, so but, but, but I think I was like, like, yeah, I gonna play it out because Jed's like Jed's so trying to rewrite the wrongs from the past and trying to really create unity and make sure there's no divide or split in the locker room, even though he kind of a little bit is kind of doing that. Mm -hmm. Um, it's pretty much all right, cool. On my dime, it's good. I want every I want my head coach, I want my core players to be like pretty much like you know, united. So I could see that being a huge case. So let's let's run it down though. Who who's the Official Cabo click. It's obviously Chris McCaffrey, George Kittle, Kyle Juszczyk. Trent Williams, Nick Debo Bosa. Samuel. Nick Bosa doesn't go, though. Nick Bosa doesn't it's go. Offensive, it's offensive guys. It's the six offensive guys. It's Trent Williams, Chris McCaffrey, Kyle Juszczyk, George Kittle, Debo Samuel. It's, it's, it's the five. It's the five. It's the, it's the weapons minus Ayuk plus Trent Williams. Minus the That's quarterback because Jimmy's never gone. No quarterback. Quarterback's not allowed. I'm just saying, if Jed York was organizing it, everyone should be invited. Everyone should be there. All expenses paid. He's over there being like, oh, I'll pay a million dollars to, to stay on the road. Okay. You organize a Cabo, pay $2 million for team bonding. Do it. Well, maybe you know some players are like, nah, I'm, I'm cool off Cabo. Because Cabo's kind of- That's an expensive of, trip. Yeah, it's expensive as hell. It's expensive as hell. A lot of these guys don't make that much money. You know what I mean? I, I, you, 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 you keep 50% of your- Essentially, 50% of your check. You know, you don't know how long you're going to be in the NFL. You can't just be going to Cabo if you don't have that, that mega deal. You, I mean, you got to be, you got to have a money manager. They won't, they wouldn't recommend going to Cabo. They'd say, mm, don't. I can't believe Fred Warner doesn't catch an invite have at you, least. Is Fred Warner there? He might have gone once. Is Fred Warner there? It seems like he would be in the Cabo. I don't think consistently. Yeah, I mean, you play defense. I could have sworn I've seen him yeah. one time, but uh, maybe that's just in He my seems head. like he's definitely part of the Cabo click. At least, they, like, they would do FaceTime calls with him if he wasn't there. Hey, it's Fred! Hey, what's up? <laughs> well, I mean, All right, speaking of... Has been sticking ahead. around here, right? He's been sticking around here this this year. He was there for when all he's the from, guys... He's from San Diego. It's probably... He could probably, you know, get like a... He probably knows the flight to Cabo. Cabo and it's like, eh, it's whatever. I've never been to Cabo. It's like for, to Cabo's basically for Americans to go visit to Cabo and, and Cancun. What I liked about Mexico City is how much it wasn't for Americans. I was walking around like a white, like a white guy, like, oh, they're gonna speak English around here. Everyone's like, dude, we're in Mexico. I was like, oh, but they didn't say it in oh, English. Yeah, Mexico, Mexico. Yeah, I was like, okay, okay. 